shooting happened really just within about 50 yards or so behind me and Connecticut State Police say that one of their canine unit dogs, canine Brocco, has been shot and killed. They say Brocco has been with the Connecticut State Police since January of 2021. That's when he graduated from that school there. Now you can see canine Brocco in these pictures that should hopefully be popping up on your screen. CSP troopers tell us around 730 last night they went to a home on Mechanic Street to serve a felony search and arrest warrant issued by the Norwich Police Department. Now during this investigation, troopers say an altercation of some sort led to shots being fired, but they've not released any other details on how exactly that happened and how canine Brocco was involved. Troopers tell us Brocco started with CSB in South Par Southbury on the search and rescue team and then later was assigned to the CSP canine unit. They tell us he died protecting his handler, the other troopers and the community. In a statement, CSP says canine Bro Brocco was not just a loyal companion. He was a hero in every sense, embodying the values of courage, loyalty, selflessness and the highest standards of the Connecticut State Police. His sacrifice will forever be etched in our hearts and he will never be forgotten. Now, one thing I do want to mention was earlier this morning, our crews from last night were on this scene here and they say dozens, if not maybe even a hundred different state police and canine units and other officers and law enforcement from across Connecticut were here and they all then had a procession uh, around one o'clock or so this morning to escort Brocco away from this scene. Now, again, as soon as we have any other information, maybe some more details as to what exactly led to the K9 being shot and killed. We, of course, will let you know the inspector general's office has taken this investigation over. Live in Pocketuck, Brooke Griffin, Fox 61, Connecticut's news station.